So apparently, I don't know how true it is. Oh, hold on. Gotta put my pop filter over the mic. So apparently, they have added a fully auto Zip 22-esque gun to the test place. I'm in the wrong game. That's the official game. <laughs> anyway, let me try that again. <laughs> so apparently, they have added a fully auto Zip 22 type of gun to Phantom Forces. I don't know how true this is. I have not seen for myself, but all that I know is that yesterday I was sitting on my couch and I was thinking, what if they added a fully auto Zip 22 conversion? And then like an hour later, I start getting comments about some new gun being added. Oh, there's a couple new guns added. This is the one people are talking about though. So apparently this is supposed to be like a fully auto Zip 22, but I don't know. That is the loudest thing I've ever heard in my life. So it looks similar to a Zip 22, and there's really no description on this because it's it just says E. Why? I don't know. Well, let's go ahead and test this thing out and see if, uh... Oh my gosh, this thing is terrible. What are the... What are the... Okay. So we have a maximum of 26 damage. So at the very most, this is a four shot from point blank. 80 round magazine capacity. Why? This thing is so garbage. Why would anyone use this? Well, you know, I say that, but everyone in the server is using it, so. So technically, damage-wise, this thing is better than a Zip-22, though. And, you know, 80 rounds. By default. No pro mag or anything like that needed. You just select the gun, spawn in, and you're good to go. Why this is necessary to add, I don't know. But I'm glad that they're doing this, though. I like whenever they add really unique stuff to Phantom Forces. I don't like seeing nine versions of the AK-12 and then, you know, 16 M4s. So this is a good thing. So I think that it said that this was like a rank 126 gun or something at the top. I mean, anybody can use it in the test place right now. This is not limited to level, so you can test this out in the test place if you want to. But like, obviously this isn't overpowered. I feel like this is actually, like, an okay balanced gun for what it is. Because this is a pretty high, uh, high rate of fire gun, obviously. Low damage. Now, this being in the testing place, naturally we're going to have to buy some attachments here. So, first I'm going to get a compensator. Let's go for the stubby grip here. Blue laser. Just for curiosity's sake, let's put on a coyote sight. I'm really curious about the rat shot. I'll try that. Let's try the rat shot. Okay, you know what? Let's not actually, because this only has 12 bullets now. All right. So we only have automatic as far as the fire mode goes. So no, we're taking off rat shot. We don't want that. <laughs> what if we try muzzle break instead? Because it looks like you're having quite a bit of vertical recoil. Okay. 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 <laughs> I don't want this. <laughs> I'm going to take off that and I'm going to put on compensator again. Yep. There we go. That's better. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. Oh no. Guys, I'm gonna be honest, we're gaming right now. This is just a... Uh, okay, and this guy's using Scorpion. Bro, get with the meta, man! We're all using this gun! I know that this is probably going to be laughable, but honestly... You could main this. You wouldn't want to. But you really could, with just how much ammo this thing has. You know what? We're going all the way. We're getting the DCL 120. Look at this. Tell me you wouldn't want this in your home. Okay. Ugh, I'm so sad. So we're going to continue using that funny gun because it's actually... I think I forgot to mention this earlier, but it's actually a PDW. So this is this is a primary weapon here. So we can attach on one of the new secondaries to it. So we have the, I am not gonna pronounce that actually, and the Makarov. So of course, by default being a big APOC player, APOC 1 player that is at least, I'm a pretty big fan of the Makarov. It's been the starter weapon for Apocalypse Rising for many years. Okay, I like this already. It just looks so good. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> this is too much, man. This gun's just too good. See, this is a weird thing for me because I honestly went into this expecting it to be just like some crappy secondary that did like four damage with like a 10 round magazine and then that was it. But I'm honestly really liking this gun. Mostly because of how unique it is because I really like whenever they do stuff like this, like I said before. Two freaking pistol grips back to back right there. Check it out. Very swag. 
Okay. Honestly, I'm a lot more impressed with this than I thought that I was going to be originally. Granted, I've slapped a crap ton of attachments on this, but even by de like running a default like I did at the beginning whenever I was first testing it out, like, this thing is not bad. It's partially a bit of a meme gun, as you can imagine. I mean, an 80 round freaking 15 damage fully automatic thing. I mean, like, who's going to want to use that? But honestly, I think I'd have to answer that with me. I'm thoroughly amazed at the capabilities of this little freaking Rama, Rama, Rame, funny gun. Honestly, I don't know what to call this. I'm going to call it swag gun because I think this gun is very, I can't climb that because I think this gun is very swag. For now, of course, until I get bored of it in three minutes and then use something else. But for now, though, I like this gun. So let's go ahead and try out the other secondaries a little bit here. So we have the Makarov and the other one, which is basically just like an integrated suppressor on a Makarov. I'm always in the market for new secondaries. So I'm glad whenever they add them. Unfortunately, it doesn't appear that there's anybody playing the game. Because I can't... There we go. Here's somebody. And he's in the abyss now. All right. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Maybe I'm on the wrong map for maining a pistol. I don't really know. Well, I do kind of know. Let's try to get a little bit closer up to these guys. Okay, maybe maybe there's too many for that. I'm not doing so good with this. Got him. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Only an assist, but yeah. All right. All right. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I, I like this gun so far. I still will probably end up using the Scorpion over this, I'm sure. But, like, just to look at this thing, though, I freaking love the Makarov. This is modeled really nicely. It's a swag-looking gun. And it's just a little nice to have, you know? Give you some variety in terms of the pistols. Okay, yeah, but, like, my question is, why are we battling at a construction site? Let's go ahead and try out the other pistol, actually, though. So, this is the only other thing that I could see that they added, it looks like. Nothing else new, I guess, so... I guess we're just gonna test this out. So the damage is decreased on this compared to the other one. I'll have to look by how much here in a moment. But for the trade-off, though, you do get an integrated suppressor, which, you know, you could weigh your options as to whether that's a worthwhile trade-off. The base damage, or like the max damage, actually goes up a little bit. Oh, but the fire rate goes way down. But the lower end damage, so instead of it being a five-shot kill, this would be about a six-shot kill at a distance. So that's nearly your whole magazine. Oh, yeah. No, that's a much slower fire rate. It's still pretty quick, though. Like, you could still tap fire with this thing pretty fast. Alright. Yeah, I kind of like this one. But yeah, this is definitely worth taking a look at, though. I like this gun. It's 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 really cool. It's a unique thing that is just, you know... It kind of exists. Not too good, but something to just, you know, mess around with for a little bit if you're bored. Or, you know, if, you, if you're one of those guys who likes to say that the Zip-22 is the best gun in the game, you know, it's your main. It's your new main and forever will be. But alongside that, thank you guys for watching. <laughs> I appreciate it. Hope everyone's staying safe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. <gasps> oh, shoot!